Well, back in 1997, St. Hayden's United Church had a great big empty basement and one woman who had an idea of what to do with it. Well, 20 years later, her idea is still thriving and has contributed three quarters of a million dollars to the community. Veronica Cooper has more. How is the greeting going? Sylvia Campbell checks in good, with two good, of her good. 40 volunteers. Everything okay over here? Who work at the St. Aidan's Church thrift shop. We've been open for 20 years this year. We began with 16 or 17 people, and now we have over 40 people volunteering here every week. Where are you going to find the weights? I don't know. I'll, I'll have to search more thrift stores. More than 300 customers search for treasures every Wednesday and the last Saturday of the month, yet it only exists because of Sylvia's vision for the basement of this church back in 1997. All of this area was just gray cement and not being used, and I thought, well, th this would be a good idea for a thrift shop. When she had the idea of the thrift shop, she went to the stewards to ask for some seed money to start it up. Sylvia received $600. Well, this thrift shop has contributed uh, almost three quarters of a million dollars to the church and the greater community. And so that $600 has morphed into almost a million dollars. So huge vision that other people couldn't see. I've been coming here for a couple of years and you can find really good things at really good prices. And without the thrift shops, a lot of the stuff would end up in garbage. The thrift shop is known as the Friendly Octopus because its generous tentacles give back to dozens of nonprofits in the community. Every week we give to our place, of course, warm clothing and shoes to our place. And we give about 500 uh, bags a year, boxes and bags to the Salvation Army and the same to uh, the Canadian Diabetic Association and to Big Brothers and Big Sisters. So every week there's a big turnover and a lot of recycling that goes on. I love it. I come every Wednesday. I'm addicted to vintage, so I'm always looking for things. One woman's vision 20 years ago. She knew what she wanted and she had no problem getting people to help her making a huge difference in the community. Vital People is brought to you in part by the Victoria Foundation, celebrating 80 years of connecting people who care with causes that matter.